Hey guys, what's up? It's the end of my regular ass life. Whoa. Haven't said that in a long time. So, I was just watching Spoken Reasons video, uh, Should I Go Raw? First thing I watch when I got up in the morning, because, you know, I get up, I do my daily YouTube, and then, you know, I go eat or whatever. And now I know it was purely for comedy, and I have no issue with his video. I love all his videos. But there was one comment that made me think, what in the hell is wrong with y'all niggas? So the comment was basically talking about if, in the situation, he was talking about a specific girl, he should go raw. Now I'm pretty sure they were saying he should go raw because the girl's pretty. And this got my wheels to turn in yet again. How many people out there actually do have sex without a condom because the other person is pretty? If you can't see where my argument is going with this, check out my other video, Pretty People Don't Deserve Shit. But no, really, it's an epidemic that people are allowing to ruin their lives. Most STDs that you can transmit from person to person while having sex or just fooling around or any genital area getting close to any mouth or the JJ can't necessarily be seen by looking how pretty they are or by even looking at their penis or their JJ. So what I'm saying is just because somebody's pretty doesn't mean that you should go raw in them. I understand that, you know, oh, well, they look good. That means their coochie got to be good. No, it don't. Pretty people are dirty. Ugly people are dirty. Pretty people are clean. Ugly people are clean. But one thing that remains constant is you can never be exactly 100% sure which person is clean or which person is dirty just by looking at how pretty they are. And this gets me to my point. If you are out there and you are sexually active, please protect yourself. It's, it's just... It's just a really important thing to do. Matter of fact, forget it being an important thing to do. It's the smart thing to do. It's the healthy thing to do. It's the I don't want to die thing to do. And also remember that you can be carrying any STD and not even know it. So the importance of getting yourself tested and knowing your status is even more important. And I'm not just talking HIV and AIDS. I'm talking about everything across the spectrum. And remember, ladies, there are some things that when you go in for STD testing, they don't test you for. So when you go to your lady doctor, ask them to test you for anything else. So the moral of the story is, don't be a dirty hoe bag. Wrap it up. Shout out to Spoken Reasons for doing that video. It definitely, you know, like I say, got some wheels turning in my head. And in case any of you guys didn't know what Spoken Reasons does in his spare time, check out this clip. And now it's time for the question of the day. What are your views on sexual protection? Leave your answer as a comment below and I might use it in next week's video.